Okay, this is a scenario where you are wondering what happened to your scores. So, in this case, to determine who won this dance, you have to calculate, do the calculation. And uh, the ballroom dancing uses what we call the scaling system for that. So, the, the letters here, those are the judges. So, we call A, B, C. So, you have five judges. Because you have five judges, you need the majority of three to win a dance. So if you don't have three, you're not going to be able to win that dance. So, as you see, couple one or three has two first places. So we need three. So therefore, we don't have majority. One of seven has only one. So therefore, it looks like by taking a glance at it, it looks like nobody has majority. So let's go over the steps to determine who's gonna win this dance, okay? Stay with me. So we go there. My line might not be straight, but we're not looking for perfection in the line right now. I wanna show you quickly. All right. In this line, we're going to be looking for first place. In this line, you're looking for second place or better, we call that. In this line, we call second, third place, fourth place, fifth place, and then one, one, two, six. And at this time, this is the result. Okay, ready? Okay, now we count the number of first place. Now we see number 103, couple 103 has 1 and 2. So we put 2 first place. Okay? And couple number 107 has only 1 first place. Couple 111 has no first place. Couple 121 has no first place. Couple 126 has only one. And couple 143 has one. So therefore, nobody has majority. So we cannot determine who won that dance. So therefore, we go to the next placement, which is second place. So when you count second place, you count also first place because first place is better than one, uh, than two. So we count second or better, which is one and two. So we count one, two, that still give you two. How many second place and better? We have one, two. So we count two. This one has no second place. This one has one, two. And this one has one, two. And this one has one, two. Huh. Still no majority because you, we're looking for three. Okay, so we go to the next one. Next one we have one, two. Still two. We have one, two. We still have two. Here we have one, two, three, four. Oh, that's a majority. We have one, two, three. That's a majority. And we have two here and we have one two here so here is getting interesting because we have couple one 111 has four at four third place and couple 121 has three therefore we're gonna since we're looking for first place we have to assign first place to this couple because they have the most here. And then this is rule that's this is rule number six. When we go back to the scaling system, if you study the study scaling system, rule number six, that that's the application of rule number six. Okay? And then this one has the the, the second majority, so this one is the second place. So we have a winner right now. As you can see. This couple doesn't have any first place or second place at all. 
it's only half third place and 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 better and but yet won the dance so you don't really have to win every dance to win it you know <laughs> so this is uh this is tricky because um that happened to me before when I competed as, uh, as amateurs and I was trying to understand my score. And uh, I look at the score and I'm saying, how come this couple didn't get any first place but won the dance? I get mad. I even went to talk to um, the organizer. <laughs> That's how mad I was. But yet, then um, when they explained to me, he said, uh, go see the scrutineer. So, when I talk to a scrutineer, he explained to me, this is what happened. Now that I'm a, a scrutineer certified because I kind of study it now, I pass my test, so I understand why that happened. So, yes, this is the scaling system they're using, and according to the scaling system, this is the correct answer. So, as you see, 111 is a winner, 121 is a second place, now to, the, to go for the third place, we go to the next column. So, so column one to four, we have one, two, three, four. This one has five. And then this column has one, two, three. So we have three. Mm -hmm. And this one already got his mark, his placement. So we're looking for this one now. We have one, two, still two and one two so we, when we count one to four we still have two here so therefore it's very simple here we have the application of rule number six in the scaling system tells you this couple has the most majority so we're gonna assign third place to this couple and this one will have the fourth place very simple and we go to the next round next column to determine the uh, the next placement. So and now we are basically looking at only two couple, 126 is 120 and 143. So we count the fifth column, one, two, three, four. This one has four. And this one has one, two, three. And they both have majority, and, but this one has the most majority, so therefore you assign number fifth place to so here and this one will get the sixth place. That's how it's done.